everyone and welcome to my channel. Today I'm here again with Celeste. Hi hi! And as you might have seen in the title, today we're doing a review. Now I don't know about you, but often times I make my own costumes. I don't buy it online that often. But when I do, I like to use um, AliExpress because they have review photos. Yeah, they have a lot of good costumes for good quality and for a low price. Mm, yeah, like, I feel like you, you know a lot of the costumes I can make better myself. But like a lot of the other costumes, it's just easy to buy it. Like with a yeah, sensei yeah. suit, it's just easy. I did that. I did that with my diva costume. Yeah, right, so. right. And I have done that a lot of times and enjoy it. So it's part of cosplay. And uh, today I'll be doing a review on the birds of prey costumes I ordered from them. Now you might remember back a few weeks ago, um, together with Celeste, we did a tutorial on the birds of prey confetti jacket and full costume. We had the full costume on your channel, and we have the wig and the makeup and behind the scenes vlog on mine. Anyways, um, so when I ordered this I didn't I didn't want to get like the shorts too. So there was not an option to get only the white shirt but there was an option to get the white and shirt and the bra. Now I actually wanted to make this myself but I could not find the fabric for it. That's it's it, life in Denmark be like. <laughs> life in Denmark, hey you want something? No. First I want to show this is a bra I got. Now I, I originally didn't Need this because we already made a wig one and we made one of love it that I like a lot. So, this originally came with um, a cops in it. Mm -hmm. I removed those because I usually wear brown on it. I did try it once before uh, doing this review. Um, I removed them because it, uh, when wearing them, it was, was visible. So, oh, really? Was yeah, it... so you can see like the white like pads. Oh, that's Ugh. And I was like, okay, this is not gonna work for me. But like, then I took them out and I put a bra underneath, and then it was like, super. Oh, that's perfect. And you can see like for $16, which was the price I paid like plus minus, but mm -hmm. around $16 for um, for the costume and for the shipping, I think it was decent price and for that price I am actually really shocked about how good quality this is. I'm like kind of shocked that it actually has texture though. Yeah. Because like Harley Quinn has some kind of texture on her bra. I mean mm -hmm. it's not the fuzzy texture but it, it has texture. So. I think it's burnout. Mm -hmm. So like... It's nice that they have have something on it. I, I was expecting to get like um, like kind of just cheap spandex or something. Yeah, maybe like that, like yeah. like a cross, something like that. But like too, like when you said that it's kind of like a sports bra. Like I mean, do you think you could also work out in this if you had if mm -hmm. you wanted to? Definitely. So multi-purpose. So I don't want to because that will make I it mean, smelly. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> but um. I could and I would. Um, now this is a bit small in size. They do run small in sizes, okay. and they usually do that um, because they are Asian sizes. So I, mm -hmm. I did expect that. I, I wish it wasn't because uh, yeah, that would have been nice. But like um, I can wear it. I have worn it. Yes. Um, and it's actually you know decently nice. It's comfortable and it's not accurate. No, it's it definitely that. not accurate. It's no. just a pink like sports bra. Like like you can get that anywhere. Right, so if you really don't want to like make one following our tutorial, like you could just you can just grab this. Like mm. it's pretty easy. It's, it's a Is decent it, price. Would you say it's Stina approved? It's Stina approved. It's Nobel approved. I, I like it. Um, I think it's nice. And um, the good thing I do. Um, like about this that we didn't include in ours is that um, it has elastic band down below. Oh. So when I'm wearing it, it's like. It's loose. It's tight. Okay. And the other one is it's pretty loose and when you lift your arm it can go a bit up. Oh. It doesn't do that. Oh, that's So smart. that I appreciate a lot. Um, but let's get to... The main event! The main event. It's so. the white shirt. Oh, here we are. Here Look we are. This. So what I want to say is that I cut the neck open. It was rough edges like this, but I figured that it wasn't like wide enough, so mm -hmm. I, I, I cut my own, uh, my own lap, it, you know, um... Your own neckline. Yeah, you know, ne neckline, and um, yeah, and that made it work for me. Right. So, there's some print on it, and um, it's not exactly copied to how it is in, um... In the show, in the, in the, in the actual movie. Well, we, the movie hasn't come out yet, but like, it's not the actual way, it's, it's the screen screenshot, but it's very, very similar. Like, you can see, um... Like, there are some cutoffs here that are supposed to be there. Right. Right. So, they are supposed to be there, but like, uh, not exactly the same placement as in the movie. I don't mind that. I think it's nice that it, 
like, has the cutoff printing on it. Mm -hmm. And, like, it's not so bold on the printing either, because no. it looks like it's actually part of the fabric. Like, it's not just, like, painted on top. No. No, and that was my in initial idea to do that. Mm -hmm. um, but I couldn't find a shirt this transparent. Or, like, the fabric. The fabric like this is really hard to find. Yeah, but, but yeah, especially in Denmark. 14, especially in Denmark. I have I have been able to find it online, but it would cost the same as just getting this shirt. I would have got this shirt anyways. Yeah, like, right. just buying this is so much more, like, it's, it's a time saver, yeah. you know? Like, I really, uh, personally, I would prefer to use, like, my effort on the jewelry and the wig and the makeup, oh, like, rather than, you know, like getting it, like getting the material and then printing it and then cutting it into a shirt. But like the printing here, so you can see, it's very, it's very smooth. Um, I don't know how well you can see it, but it's like, yeah, it's very smooth. It's, it's very well made, actually, especially compared to the price. Oh my goodness! Like this looks like just a fun shirt to own. Like honestly, because like the inside, it's well stitched. Yeah, There's it's... no missing threads. Mm -mm. It doesn't skip out. No. So. It's very well made, so um, I do I do really enjoy this, and for me it's like um, a perfect like opportunity to wear the costume without wearing an inconvenient jacket. Oh yeah, that because, jacket. Like, uh, the jacket is um, you have hopefully hopefully seen it already. The jacket is um, amazing. I love it, but it's also like loud. A chore. So this is good because it's comfy. It's it's, it's like. Comfortable. Comfortable. Comfy. Yeah. Comfortable. Yeah. And like, if you're doing like a small, you know, not necessarily convention, but like one day event, mm -hmm. uh, then it's more practical. I think it's also a good alternative to having like her other outfits. So mm. if you're not good at sewing, like, even though we have tutorials and you just, God forbid, hate sewing, like, this is such a great alternative. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. So. I really think so. And as I said, it does come with the shorts. Now, I did not get the shorts. If you want to get them with the shorts, you can do that. And all you need to get is, is the suspenders and um, the boots and socks. Yeah, basically. Yeah. Now, uh, I do have one complaint though. What is your complaint? I got the biggest sizes that was um, because I wanted it really loose fitting. Right. It's not as loose fitting as I would have liked, honestly. I don't know, I'm a bit plus size and that's not a secret. But like, uh, I feel like um, they have a very small size range. That would suck. I feel like that's like a big problem that a lot of people have mm. is that they don't have good sizes for everyone to be yeah. inclusive for cosplay. Exactly. And that's such a shame because you're excluding a lot of people. Right. So, um, as this shirt is supposed to be loose fitting and I, I will say this fits me. Mm. Uh, it's still loose. It's still like it's supposed to be but I have, would have liked it like maybe a size bigger. Mm -hmm. And they did not sell that. So, but what are your shame. favorite things? Because you said there was a bad thing, so what is your top 100% favorite thing of this item? Ab about the, the shirt here? Right. Oh, uh, well, that's difficult. I really like the, the fabric. Like, it's see-through as it's supposed to be, but not, like, transparent. Right. As the jacket is. Um, but I also really do love the print quality, and I love... I love the print. I think the print is nicely done, and I do think, like, the seams are nicely sewn, there's no, no left of a thread, and... The edges are supposed to be raw, but like, yeah. This I would rate, mm, I think it's a solid 8 out of 10, and I think that's very good for you. 8 out of 10. That is think? really good. So like, not necessarily judging on this piece alone, because like, my standard is a little bit higher. I wouldn't have wanted it to be just a sports bra. Mm -hmm. For functionality, like, you could just go out with this, you know? Yeah. I would definitely say like this. I, I like. I don't hate it, but I don't love it. It could be more. So it, this is a five by itself. But mm. this, like this, to me is like, I don't. I don't know the placement per se, like no. for real, real. But from my untrained eyes, like I would give it like a good eight or a ten, at uh, eight out of ten, because I'm just like, well, like I'm not sure because like if she had altered this the neckline to fit better, like. I, I would I don't like having to do stuff like that. Like if I want to buy something, then I don't mm. want to have to like fix it. But I think like the shirt itself here is to me ten out of ten actually. Mm -hmm. But the bra drags it down because it's not like screen accurate at all. And no. I think what drags it most down to an eight for me is that they don't have another sizes. Right. They should have more sizes. 
but that's okay. So that's that's okay, but I still I'm pretty satisfied with this, and I think it's a great addition if you have already done a, a Prince of Prey costume, especially the one with the confetti jacket. Oh yes. Um, if you have done that, I think this is a great addition, so you can still bring the cosplay, but still be more um, comfortable. So yeah. You know what's great about this one? Hmm? It's perfect for summertime, so you'll go out in shorts, a bra, and a really loose t-shirt. Yes. Woo! Correct. Cool. So yeah, that's it what we have for today. Remember to subscribe to Celeste channel and subscribe to me. All the uh, links are down in the description below and in the cards. And remember to check out our other Birds of Prey videos because we've done a lot. <laughs> yeah, we have a nice playlist so you can check out all the videos in order for mm -hmm. the full Harley Quinn look from Birds of Prey. Yes. Yay! So that's all we got. Thank you so much for watching and happy cosplay!